Hey guys, this is Scott from Trim That Weed. And today we are going to talk about how to reset a ream furnace. This video will take you through easy steps that will help you reset your furnace. So stick around for the best guide. Here is the step-by-step -step process on how to do this. Turn off the power to the furnace. The first step in resetting your ream furnace is to ensure that you have completely shut it down to prevent any risk of electric shock. You can locate the power switch on or near the furnace unit and switch it off. If you can't find any switch on the unit, turn off the circuit breaker that supplies power to the furnace. Wait for a few minutes. In the second step, once it's turned off, wait at least 5 to 10 minutes for the furnace to cool down and clear any error codes stored in the system memory. Also, this waiting period helps it reset its internal components and dissipate residual energy. Find the reset button on your ream furnace. After waiting, the next step is to locate the manual reset button. It's usually a small red or yellow button on the furnace control panel or blower motor. Refer to your furnace's user manual for the exact location as placement can vary between different models. If you need help finding it, there is no reset button or the user manual needs to be clarified, contact your HVAC company for further guidance. Press reset button. With the furnace still powered off, press the reset button firmly, holding it down for about 30 seconds. When you hear a clicking sound, it indicates that the furnace is attempting to restart itself. Depending on your REAM model, observe if there are any indicators such as lights that are blinking or changing color during the reset process. Restore power to the furnace. Once the reset completes, power on the furnace and watch for error codes or warning lights. The furnace should be able to start its normal heating cycle if the reset is successful. Observe the furnace for any issues. If the furnace still fails to start, or shows the same error codes, there may be a more severe issue and it would be best to contact a professional HVAC technician to check and repair the problem. So there you have it. With these easy steps, you can reset your ream furnace. Do you have any comments or questions? Make sure to drop them below and like this video. Till next time.